to get away from that heat tomorrow. There are dozens of cooling centers that will be open around the state, including 10 in Hartford alone. Channel 3's Dylan Fearon is outside one of them right now. He's joining us live at the library on Campfield Ave with more on how folks are going to deal with the heat. Dylan. Yeah, Mark, good evening. So most of the cooling centers around the state are public libraries or town community centers. And if you're outside all day, tomorrow, Friday, Saturday, it may be good to just pop in and relax, get some water, cool off, and just catch your breath for a little. If today is a preview for tomorrow, it could be brutal. This is too hot. Stacy from Tolland might be too hot, but it could be worse tomorrow. Make sure you're drinking water. That's the biggest key. 14-year-old Broden worked outside all day. He still made it out to Vernon's Summer Days Carnival. I, I was sweating a lot. Uh, a lot of a lot of wood being flipped, 100-pound logs to bring to a splitter. It was a lot. Broden could have used a cooling center. Many public libraries and community centers are open in the morning for people to relax and get away from the sun. At the carnival, hydration is key. Everyone in this family has a water bottle, and volunteers are going through 60 cases a day. The heat wave comes along. There's a lot of people here that are over 50 years old did, doing all this volunteer work. And they're working in the heat. In the heat. And they, you never hear any one of them say anything negative about it. Public pools in Hartford stayed open a little later today so kids could cool off longer. And despite the heat, the Rocky Hill Farmer's Market was still buzzing. Yeah, we're staying stay indoors in, quite stay a bit, indoors. unfortunately. Yeah, I mean, what else can you do? Listen to your body, but also help your body be prepared. Preparing by drinking plenty of water and replenishing electrolytes. You should be drinking in every hour or so, getting 8 to 16 ounces in if you're outside. A little less if you're inside, but use common sense as to how much you're exerting yourself. Enough water for the day. You know, definitely having food, you know, that's, that's, that's important. So again, there's plenty of cooling centers around the state. If you're looking for one near you, we have a full list on our website, WFSB.com, and on the Channel 3 app. So check that out tonight. We're live in Hartford. I'm Dylan Fear in Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Dylan.